what we're doing is we're making your plane of occlusion, in other words, the length of your teeth and the angle that they're at, matching your eye plane so that everything is balanced. So most folks have to really understand that as they get older, they're going to have to deal with the issues that they have as far as their teeth are concerned. Uh, we now have the technology to be able to do things that are lasting uh, for a really long time, and most folks feel a little bit more comfortable knowing that they're not going to have constant deterioration of their teeth. In, in the past, and actually the way we learned it in dental school, this often became a six month to year long ordeal. In our office, because of the combination of both my husband and myself treating a patient, plus our staff, which is very highly trained for this particular procedure, um, this is a two week procedure. I had decided that I wanted to do it and um, wanted to have my smile recreated and I was a little nervous. I was a little anxious about how it would feel, how long it would take. I was afraid of needles, all those kind of things and they put all my fears aside and worked with me and said, Gina, we're gonna, you're not going to experience any pain. It's going to be wonderful. We're going to take care of you. Everybody will be here watching over you and sure enough it actually happened. I couldn't believe it. The first thing I did was I looked, they hand you a mirror, you get to get out, rinse off, they hand you a mirror, and I went, ah, oh, I have, I, I can see the color of my eyes. My father has beautiful blue eyes, and a couple of my kids got them, and I didn't, I thought, well, that's not fair. They kind of skipped me, but I think to compensate for my smile and my teeth, I was smiling kind of in an unusual way, and my eyes were kind of squinting together, and I just never saw them before. When a patient undergoes having a virtual facelift, the musculature of the face, which has been collapsed and is falling down and gets you poochy cheeks, um, allows the lips to roll in and your eyes to crinkle up. And in order to smile, the facial muscles pull up higher and the eyes tend to squint. With the musculature stretched out, as with uh, the elongated facial structure that occurs with the, a dental virtual facelift, the eyes actually open up because the musculature is stretched out and that's what happens. Additionally, what ends up happening is when the foundation is reset with the lips because the teeth are a little bit longer from where they were, the structure of the teeth actually supports the lip more and actually fills out that area so that many times the lines around the lips not only here but here become less noticeable, which is why it's a virtual facelift and not a real facelift. It's just re-establishing the support of the foundation. One of my good friends that's a patient here came in just yesterday and she walked up to the counter and she goes, Gina, oh, you got your teeth done. Oh my goodness, you look like you're 15 years younger. And I went, no, stop telling me that. No way. And she said, you really do look younger, Gina. I think I'm going to sign up. <laughs>